Welcome, Taurus. Thank you for listening to your reading of May 14th, 2023 on your Zodiac Attraction channel, where you will know what the future holds, both in money, your numbers for today, love, health, work and family. So subscribe to the channel, so you don't miss anything. You'll find yourself in a romantic and sentimental headspace throughout the next several weeks, sweet bull, as Venus migrates into Cancer and your solar third house. These vibes are perfect for showing your vulnerable side, though you'll want to establish trust before laying all your cards on the table. You may also need more time to recharge at home between social gatherings, so try not to overfill your calendar with outings. Plan on closing out the weekend with some peace and quiet as the Pisces moon and Chiron join forces overhead, putting you in a private and introspective headspace. You will have to put your trust into another person today. This person can be someone close to you a friend or a relative. He or she will help you in some crucial task which will significantly affect your future, but the key here is the trust that you will have to place in that person. This will require a leap of faith on your part. It's Friday and while you might have some interesting plans brewing on the back burner, you really ought to stay focused on the here and now and make today really count on the work front, because chances are your effort will be well worth it. The moon is moving through your ambitious 11th house of career goals and professional success, so even if it is indeed a day of rest, you're still ready to hit the ground running. This vibration receives an extra boost of energy thanks to a very strong beam from the primal sun currently parked in your first house of self-expression and action. The sun is on his annual tour of your sign, making you the celestial favorite du jour, so make this cycle count. It'll be hard for people to miss you on a day like today, just be careful not to push them out of the way during your ascent to the top. Today, your aggressiveness and generosity will make you approachable to others seeking your help. Your wit and charisma may amaze others around you. You may be the center of attention on the social scene as a result of your charitable efforts. You must allow your companion time to better understand you before you can anticipate a definite commitment from them. Married people are more likely to have physical closeness in their relationships. You are likely to be presented with new and intriguing work prospects. However, acting quickly might backfire. Choose a career that you are passionate about with prudence. If you suffer from recurring ailments, you may not find rapid relief. This may bother and concern you. Calming strategies may improve your attention and overall wellness. Mercury's retrograde ends today, dear Taurus, helping to release blocks or delays. The shift itself occurring now can be on the confusing side, so take your time. In the coming days, you'll benefit from a more straightforward approach to life but observe and process before jumping into decisions. Delays will lift, and periods of limbo should end as information or a new perspective emerges. Still, ease into moving your plans ahead for the best results. The moon is in your friendship sector all day encouraging you to seek like-minded people or friends who accept you for who you are. Relationships tend to fare well, particularly with patients. Wait, however, for making significant commitments. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and Luck Forge closer work relationships, Taurus. Now is the time to take a more cautious approach to your immediate work community and conversations with coworkers when Venus enters Cancer. As this Venusian energy unfolds, you may feel more sentimental and compassionate. Do not be surprised if you begin reminiscing on all you have done and been through with your coworkers during this transit. Use this energy to your advantage since it could help affirm your rapport with your coworkers which can ultimately lead to more fulfilling relationships. Right now you need some financial security, but don't let caution make you become mean. Down-to-earth thinking and well-planned financial measures are sufficient. There won't be any big surprises right now anyway. Reward yourself with a little something instead of denying yourself all the time. Some powerful energy fills the sky and encourages you to expand your horizons outwards, Taurus. 
New opportunities can generate from the conversations you have with others at this time and today marks the start of new and exciting ideas that can lead to something truly productive. Big changes are on the way for you and you may have to tighten your belt. However, as long as you keep a good balance and don't go overboard when the mood strikes, you will be pleasantly surprised by the outcome, Taurus. Lucky Numbers Your lucky numbers for May 14th are 29, 31, 16, 20, 17, 34. Daily Love A gorgeous few weeks lie ahead of you, Taurus. As Venus, your planetary ruler and the planet of romance and love, ventures upon the beaches and shallows of Cancer, you'll feel right at home. With our lesser benefic highlighting your solar third house of communications, you'll have the special touch to seduce or persuade anyone you wish. For couples, this is a great period for love notes, sweet promises, and doting compliments on your sweetheart. This is a great time for singles to show off their wit, charm, and humor. Dazzle others with your thoughts. To avoid a constant feeling of irritability, you should let your sweetheart know about the fact, too little caressing can often lead to frustration and to a tensed-up atmosphere. Yes, I want you to hold me in your arms and to feel your hand on my shoulder. There is nothing wrong with expressing your needs, as long as your tone of voice is not unnecessarily accusing. The moon is in Pisces and in your 11th house. How can you allow your romantic relationship to be an example for others of what an ideal relationship looks like? When I say an ideal relationship, I mean one that is built on honesty, one where both partners feel permission to be themselves totally and completely while constantly challenging one another to grow. You might think my relationship isn't something to be displayed or showed off to the outside world, but we could all use more examples of successful relationships. Therefore sharing that with the word from a place of positive intention would truly be a gift to everyone. Let that love between you and your lover shine onto everyone. At work. If you have applied for a job, check with the company. You may receive some good news regarding your job. A promotion or an increment is on the cards today. It is an auspicious day for any kind of investment. If you have been planning for buying a property like house, day is favorable for you and you may cut a good deal. Forging a completely new path is rewarding. Believe in your own ideas, assess the feasibility and don't pull back from career changes or making difficult choices. You've a grasp of new assignments and are able to master problems with ease. Unexpected support is forthcoming and you gladly accept without reservation. Today is a good day to ask yourself am I where I want to be in my career? The moon is in Pisces and in your 11th house. If you feel like you're not, why is that the case? Now what's even more important than reflecting on where you want to be, is taking action, as in the necessary steps to get to your desired destination. And if it's not possible that whatever happens to call you to be what you do for work, work on it on the side as a hobby. Health. The day is perfect to indulge in some special time for yourself. Go for a massage or a beauty treatment and you will come out feeling great. You are also likely to get some good news regarding your health and fitness. You can also experiment with different health regime to find out which one is best suited for you. You've wanted to start jogging for a while, it's as good a time as any to begin. You sense a surge of energy, feel fit and full of vitality. Don't forget to organize a peaceful weekend away every so often, give your body some deserved rest and relaxation. A positive approach helps you to organize regular activities. During the last quarter moon, it's important for you, Taurus, to focus on self-care and nourishment. Taking care of your body with nutritious foods like leafy greens and whole grains will help you feel energized and grounded. Incorporating gentle exercises like yoga or stretching will help you release any tension and stress in your body. The crystal rose quartz can help you open your heart and connect with your emotions. Family and friends. A new and promising relationship will develop in life of those who are single. However, ego and lack of farsightedness is going to cause problems in cultivating this relationship further. They may also cause trouble in a relationship which you are already having. 
it is necessary to take a step back and give your partner enough space as you have been encroaching too much upon his slash her personal space. There is a lot going on in the heavens today, thanks to a disruptive square between the sun and the moon, the two most influential bodies in the skies above. The primal sun recently entered your sign for a month-long stay, during which time he is filling you from within with all his bountiful energy and passion, which is of course always an invigorating time in life and also a wonderful cue from the universe to wholeheartedly pursue your desires. Today, however, that program gets checked by the fact that the intuitive moon is moving through your 11th house of professional goals and accomplishments. Your wild pleasure cruise will get put on hold while work matters come first, so know that instant gratification isn't exactly sitting at the top of today's menu. Don't worry, there are sexier skies coming your way, just not today. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.